The title of my film, Static, was chosen mainly to fit the art direction of my film. It, it fit the themes of my film, being stuck in one place, not having any direction in life. I also made this decision due to audience research I carried out. I did a survey asking what title I should use. This directly involved my target audience, so secu securing the suitability of this title. My opening was in various different settings. It started in a middle class looking house, and then slowly, throughout the opening, progressed into a more working class run down area. This transition partly symbolised the journey that my character had made in his life, from being in a wealthy family to having to live quite a basic life. This run down area was chosen as if it the conventions of social realism as a genre. The working class grey skied run down areas of estates are very conventional in other social realism films, such as This Is England and A Room for Romeo Brass, two films I researched. This is why I chose this location. I did not have many props on my opening. This was because I wanted to portray the cliché of all a character having is the bag on his back and money in his pocket. This is why I chose the bag I did, as I felt the design of the bag made a statement about my character's past, due to its label, but also showed the simplicity of his life now. I dressed my character in quite average boyish clothes. I wanted the clothes to be simple, a check shirt and jeans. This, to the, this was to make the boots he was wearing stand out. Having statement clothing is quite common in social realism, such as the skinheads in This Is England and the mods in Quadrophenia. The clothing and props presented my character, Oliver, in a way that I felt made my audience relate to him. Things like when he lights a cigarette and his boots also present him as quite rebellious. The font I used for my opening was very frantic and moved around quickly. I wanted a very standout font to draw the audience in more. I also chose this to suit my target audience, as my target audience are young. I wanted quite a rebellious looking font to attract my audience straight away. In my opening not a lot of my story is shown, due to results of a survey I did. That said, my audience did not like a lot of the story being given away early on. I also did, did, did this to raise enigma codes, small hints that the house did not belong to my character, such as him climbing out the window, or made the audience wonder and watch on. I feel my opening is very well stylized to fit the genre. The visual elements, such as location and clothing, were all chosen to fit social realism. The music I chose was also chosen to fit the genre. I chose a British song by a male singer, the kind of music my character and audience would listen to. Picking music that fits the characters and time period of the film is very common in social realism. In my opening, I had some very long shots, similar to some I saw in other social realism films I researched. One shot in particular that I took a lot of care in composing was the one of my character walking in front of the Salvation Army building. I felt the long shot of him walking was very effective and also gave small hints to the, what my character's background was. To contrast that, the longer duration shots, I also had some very quick snappy shots, such as when my character is doing up his shoes. This made the opening more visually stimulating.